Oh, this is jacking me up, man. Good morning, folks. At, well, that's when I'm recording this, but afternoon or good evening. I'm Don. This is Rocket the Country. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't. I ask that every so often just to keep the ball rolling. I'm doing a request today by Terry Barnes. Terry, shout out to you. Terry knows his stuff when it comes to music. So uh, I'm doing Pam Tillis, Let That Pony Run. I don't know who or what the pony refers to in this. It might be an actual pony, but it's usually not. Let's see why Pam wants to let that pony run. Ooh, it didn't start the way I expected. Had the perfect suburban life. Love her voice. Till her husband came clean with the help of Jim Bean. And confessed all his sins one night. Ah, shit. Said he'd fall in love with the barmaid. Said she made him feel reckless and young. When he was through. Let that pony run. Oh, she's gonna let him do it? Cause you do what you gotta do. And you know what you know. Hang on till you can't hang on. Then you yeah. learn to let go. Oh. <laughs> this is jacking me up, man. <laughs> you know, the longer you live in life, if you actually give a crap, if you have a conscience, this kind of stuff will just get to you, man. Ah, all right, here we go. And you hold on till you can't. I want to see where they go with this turn of phrase, let the pony run, let him leave. Mary moved to West Virginia. All right. After the shock wore off, she got a divorce and a chestnut horse and a bar. That it makes her feel reckless in young. Oh. She just closes her eyes as she holds on tight, and she lets that pony run. Cause you do. See why Lauren Mastetti worked with Pam, or vice versa. Yeah, it's absolutely gorgeous, absolutely beautiful. What a good song for Pam to sing. Terry, you nailed that one, my friend. Uh, what? Uh, I can relate to this. I mean, you saw me sort of like squirming, like I could just feel myself like holding on to, and 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 until you can accept that it's over, you just listen. You know, at least you got an explanation as to why. You don't always get one. 
And when somebody leaves you, sometimes they just say, I don't like you, I don't love you, or here's my problem with you, but they don't tell you the full story. And in this case, she got her answer, which sucked. She moved to West Virginia. But yeah, I was right in the sense that I was wondering what the songwriter would do with that lyric, let that pony run, because it could be used in multiple contexts. So usually it's drawn upon at least in two different contexts in the song. Sometimes they'll do three or four, depending on what the, the expression is. But you could feel her. Yeah, Pam was the perfect voice for this, and she reminded me of someone else in this, too. Every so often, she'd hit a note, carry it a certain way, and it so reminded me of someone else. It wasn't Courtney Patton. I'll think of it at some point, but I'm going to rate this song, and how good was that sliver of life? Uh, the number that struck me was a 9.6. Yeah, it was just perfectly sung, and it just depicted a, a very sad part of life, but the instrumentation let you feel it, and that's it. So Terry Barnes, shout out to you again, my friend. That was a good one. All right, folks, have a great day. I'll see you on another video. Keep rocking the country. Hey, everyone. Since I'm a life coach, some folks have reached out to me on the channel and asked me how they can get in touch with me for personal coaching or life coaching or how it even works just to discuss life issues that they're having. Maybe it's a relationship issue. Maybe it's a career choice. Maybe it's trying to find meaning to life or soul searching. These sorts of considerations are what I address in my life coaching and personal coaching sessions. So if you'd like more information, you can email me. The information is in the description box below, either at rockinthecountry at gmail.com or my personal life coaching email, which is echelonpersonalcoaching at gmail. That's also in the description box below, as is the link to my website. Our conversations are via telephone and are confidential. So if you want more information, you can go to the, my website, echelonpersonalcoaching.com. For those on the channel, I've kept it at the same rate when I started, which is $125 per hour. If there are special considerations financially, I also look at that and we'll take that into consideration. And you and I can discuss that. So feel free to reach out to me. I'm here to help. I look forward to hearing from you and have a wonderful day.